today we're going to show you how to spot a shoplifter. Now, shoplifters love to look up at the counter as soon as they come into the store. They got to see what they're working with. Is it busy? Who's working? Is it a peon? Is it a manager? Is it Jack Marius Meridius Maximus? Hopefully not. That's why they always got to look up at the counter to find out. Now, most shoplifters love items that are easy to conceal for obvious reasons. So if you see a potential shoplifter make their way into the candy section, you really got to keep a good eye on them because they'll hit you with the look of confusion out of nowhere. Thieves love that move. You'll see it a couple more times. Now, he's going to reach down there and he's going to grab a pack of Starburst. He's going to bring it in real close. He's going to keep crouching and he's really hoping that the cashiers didn't see him grab that pack of Starburst. So he's going to continue to pretend like he can't find what he wants. He's going to finally stand up. He's going to look up at the counter one more time for insurance and then he's going to slide that pack of Starburst into his left pocket. Cue the look of confusion. Uh-oh, looks like he's having a hard time finding the decoy item. Wait a minute, there it is. So he's going to grab the decoy item. He's going to smell his pit real quick. Yep, that smells. And then he's going to do another thing all shoplifters love to do. Touch stuff that they have no intentions on buying. You're not buying dog toys. What are you touching them for? So once he's done with the touching random things phase, he's going to put the toys back and he's going to make his way to the other side of the store. You know, you got to do the full loop around. You also got to keep that look on your face of what the heck? Where's the thing that I'm looking for that they don't have? Man, this store sucks. Oh, look, some vodka. Wait a minute. I can't get vodka. Oh, wait a minute. I think I want some ice cream. Oh, snap. Look at confusion. Nope. They don't have the ice cream I want. None of those 500 options appeal to me. So once he's done with the full lap around the store, he's going to make his way into the candy aisle again. You got to make that decoy item drop off. So he's going to make his way down. He's got that look of confusion. He's going to shake the candy bag. You really got to make sure the cashiers hear you put the item away. And then obviously you got to walk up to the counter empty handed. So they think, oh, he just changed his mind. Cue the thief scratch. Yep, there it is. Never fails. So he's just going to stand up at the counter, wasting his space so that the guy who just got in line behind him can't pay for his stuff. How convenient. So he's just standing there looking at the lighters. He's not going to buy any, but as long as you make the cashier think you're interested, they won't think you're a thief. So hit him with another look of confusion and then the cashier will really think that you're not a thief and he's just going to think you changed your mind. So let's just pound my hands, pound my hands, you know, just keep pounding my hands. So now that he's clearly not buying anything, he's going to make his way over here to this little cooler. He spotted a sign that he wants to read. So he's going to go over there. He's going to read that sign for a couple minutes. I'm not going to show you that in real time, obviously. So I sped it up. Now his buddy's got to go. He's like, all right, let's get out of here. And he's like, no, wait a minute. And you know what? I should read that sign a little more. And there's Jack Marius Meridius Maximus. He's disappointed because he was about to confront him, but he didn't get out the door yet. So he's going to have to pull a U-turn and abort the mission. Now, both guys are over there. They're going to be looking at the sign. They're going to point at it. They're going to touch it. You know, they're really enjoying reading the sign. So they're going to continue reading the sign. You know, you got to get all those details in the fine print. Finally, the shoplifter goes, you know what? I'm ready to leave. So he turns around, hits us with a look of confusion. Always a good idea to hit him with a look of confusion before you exit the store. So he heads over to the door and in comes Jack Marius Meridius Maximus to make the bust. But he has to abort mission yet again. It looks like the shoplifter is kind of thirsty. Where's that soda machine at? Oh, it's right over there. So they're going to make their way towards the soda machine. They're going to both take different routes. Now, the shoplifter clearly has money in his hands right now, so it looks like we might actually get a purchase from him. So his friend's nice. He's going to grab a cup for him, but that confused the shoplifter. He doesn't know to grab his own or to use the one that his friend got him. He finally grabs that one and he puts it under. Pshh. Looks like he's going with some Diet Dr. Pepper. He's going to fill it about a quarter of the way up. Now, he's got to give it the taste test, you know, so he's going to put it up to his mouth. He's going to take a nice big sip, and what do you know? It just doesn't taste right, apparently. He just got a free sip of soda, so he's going to pour that back into the thing, and then he's going to go over here, and he's going to try some Mountain Dew. You know, Mountain Dew mixed with a little bit of Diet Dr. Pepper always tastes good, and he's going to try it, and what do you know? Apparently, that doesn't taste good either, so he's just going to pour that one back out. Why pay for a full soda when you can get a couple swigs for free to quench your thirst so he disposes of the cup yeah we appreciate you wasting a cup that was really nice of you so he's gonna make his way towards the door he's following his buddy and clearly jack marius meridius maximus he's got to be hiding around here somewhere but i don't know where he is oh wait a minute there he is there's jack uh oh dun, 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 dun Look, I don't care what you're, you're pulling out. Look. Have a 
Come here. right now and they're well, going to arrest you for this. I don't know what it was. I can't see. You took it. Get out of here. It's Starburst or something. No, it's not sour Skittles. It's the thing that you put in your pocket. Beat it. You're a thief. Get out of here. Don't come back here. You know you stole because you gave me the money for it. No, you're not coming back here. Private property. And that's how you spot a shoplifter. She gone.